If you can recall, I did promise on my Red Crit Nidus video that I will try the combo between a teeming virulent Nidas and the Optic of Vandal. So, how does this new combination works against high level enemies? Well, the thumbnail says it all and, as you can see, it's a pretty sick combo that you should try for yourself. The critical chance that Nidus new augment provides to the Optic of Vandal is pretty insane, that every time you shoot that laser beam, it's almost guaranteed slash prox. Yes, this is a hunter munitions setup and, it really pairs well with the Nidus teeming virulence augment. In addition, because Nidus does have a way to group enemies with his lava ability, it's really easy to maintain the crit buff from teeming virulence plus, it does allow your Optica Vandal to perform well, as it can hit multiple enemies in one shot. And lastly, the build is pretty versatile, that you can use it on almost every factions in the game. It doesn't require you to switch elements or set up, for different factions. Just add a viral hunter munitions build on your optic of Vandal, and then pair it with a decent range, power strength teeming virulent Nidas, and you are good to go. Ok, to explain the combo in details, let's head to the build section of this video. The Nidus build is pretty straightforward, all we need is a lot of power strength, so our teeming virulence augment will give us lots of critical buff bonus. In normal circumstances, I usually go with the overextended mod for this frame but, for this synergy, I decided to go with Aug Reach and Stretch for range, so it won't hurt our power strength, do remember that this build also requires range, as we need it for our lava ability, adaptation for more damage mitigation, and these two umbral mods does help give this frame additional effective health, and power strength, vigilante pursuit, for enemy radar, and as well as to give as extra chance to land critical hits with our Optica Vandal, and lastly, Hunter Adrenaline for energy refund. Now, you might experience some energy problems with this build at first, as you can see, I don't have Prime Flow on my mod setup. What I advise you to do is, do not over spam your virulence, especially at low to mid levels. Also, try to use the Xenuric Focus for its energizing dash. Sure, you use Arcane Energize if you have it, but like I always say on my video, Arcanes don't necessarily make the synergies complete. They just make it better by a little. Anyway, I'm pretty sure you will get the gameplay of this build with a couple of runs and, you won't have any problems at late game, as Hunter Adrenaline will always give you that needed energy to cast your Lava and Virulence abilities. And yes, don't forget the fact that you will restore a big chunk of your energy, once you hit enemies while they are grouped by your Lava, because you have Blind Rage on your build. Remember that energy refunded by your Virulence, is inversely affected by ability efficiency because it is always 25% of energy used, to cast per enemy. Ok, now that you know how to build a teeming virulent Snyders for this synergy, let's proceed to the Optica Vandal build. For the Optica Vandal, all we need are Rhyme Rounds and Malignant Force, to form the viral status. And then add the Hunter Munitions mod, for the Slash Prox, pair it with Point Strike, so it will have more critical chance to the point that your teeming virulence will allow you to land orange to red crits. The rest of the mods are self-explanatory, serration and heavy caliber for more damage, and as well as split chamber, and lastly, vital sense for more critical damage. So that's how you build a teeming Nidus, Optica Vandal combo. Now that you know all the details about this new synergy, go try it out for yourself if you already have the necessary components for this synergy, before leaving. Please do me a favor and give this video a like if you did enjoyed watching this video. Also, if you find this video informative, and you want to see more guides like this, then you can join Team Grind by simply clicking that big subscribe button below. We also have a Discord channel if you want to chat with our community and, I also have a Twitter account, if you wish to follow your noob leader. All links are on the video description below. Thank you so much for watching, Squad Leader signing off.